morning, everybody. Old love here, and welcome back to Gunpoint. A dip into the shadowy world of freelance spying. I've got something big. I think we can close this case tonight. Drop me a line and I'll tell you what I can. Okay. A source I trust tipped me off to a recording of everything that happened at, in Rook's office the night of Delgado's murder. It's from a second camera, one that was backed up to a secure data sec facility without the killer knowing. I need you to break into the data sec and get the recording for me. Where was the second camera? I can't tell you that yet. Who's your source? I can't tell you that yet. Why do you believe them? I can't tell you that yet. Okay, that sounds, um... Well, thanks for the information. You've been a big help. So minimal violence, right. All right, let's see what's around. Okay. All right, there we go. So now if we disconnect that, Okay. All right, so now we've got access to the green and the purple. All right. So let's see here. All right, so the green, if we connect this to there, that'll call the elevator, which is currently down there. If we connect that to there, when it dings, that'll open up that door and we can get to there, okay. All right, hack that. Go down, and we can snag the blue one here. Okay. So now if we say you to there, connect you to there, I did not mean to do that. Okay, so we've we've got it right. We've got it right. We just need to go up, trigger that so that it opens that door, disconnect that, trigger that to there. We can come down, we can snag that. Uh, the setup, all right, I'm lost now. Why do the East, Port Pol East Point Police want to store something on this server in particular? And what is it? If it was a feed, wouldn't we just receive a stream like usual? P.S. No, I'm not stealing footage of people making out for you. Ty. Okay. So wait, that... I'm highly suspicious of this. Ah. Okay, so we need to jump out and jump up pretty quick. You didn't see anything. But I'm free. All right, and we didn't hurt anybody. 
A plus, so we did make some noise, but there was zero violence whatsoever. We got the laptop, awesome. Okay, so did you find the file? Now see, we can give him the actual file or we can lie to him and say, no, there was nothing on the terminal. Seems it sounds like it was a setup. Yeah, here it is. Huh, I'll be honest. This is a dummy file I put there. You match everything we know about Selena's killer, so I had to test where your alliances, allegiances lay. I apologize for the distrust. I'm sure you understand. <laughs> no, I got lost on the plot of mission two. I'm just, I just like getting paid. <laughs> or you were close. I did wipe the data sec footage, but I didn't kill Doug. No, we're just, of course, I completely understand. All right, I'll keep looking into it. Let me know if there, if you find anything yourself. And thanks for all your help. All right, so yeah, they were totally trying to to figure out who was, who did this. All right, so I suppose we should just like dump everything into the battery power since we've got everything. Conway, this is Rook. I need your expertise. It's regarding my employee, Katie Collins. All right, well, I have the recording you've been looking for. It's from a phone call in which Jackson threatens to kill Selena if she talks. It would be enough to get Katie Collins released and my husband arrested. Oh, awesome. I can't give it to the police. I didn't obtain it legally, so it's inadmissible. That's, I'm assuming they mean that's why, not just that why. That's why I need you. I want you to copy it onto the police servers and leave a security hole for the press to find there. Will that get Collins off? I don't know. It's never been done before. But the East Point police would probably rather claim they were sitting on vital evidence than admit that they don't know how it got, how it even got there. Have you told Collins? No, and I'd appreciate it if you didn't either. She has trouble coping with the guilt with, she'd, she has trouble coping with the guilt if I bring her a coffee. I don't want her to know I'm risking my career for her. What does the evidence say exactly? Jackson says, I mean it. If you say one word about this anywhere, you'll be dead before you leave the building. Shit. You're okay with getting your husband arrested? He's gone dark. I can't believe he did it, and I don't think, and I don't know if he'll go down for it, but he put Collins in this situation, so he can damn well take the fallout. The terminal you'll need to plant it on is at the first floor of the evidence warehouse on Union. I'm sending you the, a script that'll make it vulnerable. Once it's active, I'll tip off the journalist's friend. Hijack any laptops. Okay. Let's leap up here. Turn those off. Disconnect that from there. Disconnect that from the alarm. Okay, he's looking the other way, but if I jump down, that's gonna... So we don't have to, we don't have to worry about being nice and, and gentle to them. So, boom. We'll knock him out. We can open that up. All right, so we need to, this will take us down and we can hit that one. Huh. 
<laughs> Finally relevant. Nice. So basically, the, 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 we had to hold somebody up at gunpoint, but we had to buy a gun first. All right, couple punches, there we go. Now, if we say... Let's see here. Okay, well, we can go down. Hijack that one. Click that. That will turn off the light up there. Start him walking. Hack that. All right. Lieutenant David Carrillero to Detective Goodall. Your theory. So I'm a jury. The defendant has no alibi, lives alone, and had access to all the security footage that was mysteriously erased for the night of the crime. And a re reputable local business owner will testify that she was the last person left alone with the victim. How much do I care that she did it in a weird way? The Delgado case is an easy close, Sal. With, and with your case log, we need a... We need an easy close. Just take the win. All right, you are... You are an enforcer, which is not good. All right, so disconnect that. Okay, there we go. But that's our end goal is right here. Boom, that is hacked. Boom. All right, let's disconnect that. And we can go down and just out. Because I think that's everything. Not a terribly challenging mission, that's for sure. This one was actually, like, really super easy. We even closed the door behind us. Wait, only an A? Only an A? Really? It's Kate. I uploaded the detail. I uploaded the de Wait, what? I just got the call. They found her in uh, her cell. The note said she didn't want to be a burden. Well, crap. This is Jackson. The recording you have of me is real, but it's not the whole story. Selena and I were having an affair. When I told her not to say anything, I was trying to protect her. From whom? Intex. They blackmailed me to steal a large sum of money from Rook. I used their plan to take it but I didn't give it to Intex. I was going to use it to blow the country with Selena. I was warning her to keep that to herself because I knew if Intex found out, they'd have her killed. If I didn't, if I'd known they were tapping my phone, the irony is not freaking lost. So why didn't Intex kill you too? 
They needed me to steal the money from Rook. We sometimes channel money through my firm to dodge tax. So for a day or two, the money would be in my name. If I died before transferring it to Intex, the money would go straight back to Rook when she inherited my company. Why did you even tell Selena? She was a smart girl. She wasn't going to run off with me without knowing where the money came from. I knew she wouldn't be wild about stealing from Rook, but we don't but we didn't have much choice. Giving it to Intex would be worse. And doing nothing meant Intex would go public with the affair. Cut to the chase. What do you want? I don't know how Rook got a hold of that recording, but I know why she edited it. I, and I know why she gave it to you. She knows about me and Selena, and she knows about the money. If I get arrested now, it defaults back to her. She's trying to frame me. So what do you want? The full recording. Public. Online. It proves the one Rook leaked was doctored, and it proves that I didn't kill Selena. The terminal that recorded it logged the location of both phones at the time. I was out of town minutes before she died. That terminal is in Intex Ops Center on Harvey Street. If you can get in, you can upload the full recording from there. I'll post it as an official job so you can so I can pay you securely. All right. Conway's Rook, ignore Jackson. You don't even know what he said. Did he say the recording you have of me is real, but it's not the whole story? To be honest, I wasn't listening. Intex are still bugging his phone, and I've taken over their network. I know who killed Selena. I know exactly where he is now. And I know what will happen if that recording gets out. The killer will vanish forever. The only reason he hasn't disappeared already is, is that he knows Jackson's going down for it. As soon as the cops are looking for someone else, he's gone. You want to let an innocent man go down to catch a guilty one? Not the word I would use. Jackson framed Kate Coll Katie Collins for Selena's murder, which led directly to her death. The fact that he also cheated on me and stole most of my capital just makes me less conflicted about destroying him. Point taken. Who is it? I'm withholding that until you can secure Jackson's conviction. Can we just take out the real killer, then leak the recording? You could if you knew where he was. I could if I wanted that recording leaked. But if Jackson gets out, I lose everything. The money he took broke our agreement, but it wasn't illegal. I can't get it back unless he's convicted. So you want me to co get Jackson convicted? How? The terminal that Intex... At Intex that Jackson wants you to upload the recording from, I need you to get to it and wipe it instead. Jackson goes down for Selena's murder, I get my company back, and you can do what you like to the man who killed your client. It's an easy call. That it is. I mean, either way, I'm going to get 8000 8, bucks for it. Let's up our power capacity to full... Uh, I think we're going to go with Rook. I think we're going to go with Rook. Because, yeah, Kitty Collins is dead because of this whole shebang. All right. So. Let me... Let's disconnect everything here. All right. We've got a red button. A red button that's going to go over to there. All right, so we need to get down to where that.
All right. So now that door's open, which is great. I think, <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, okay. So that door's open and we can get to the green, the green switch at least. All right, maybe we should be down here so that he's not gonna see us when he comes through. Whoop, up and over. All right, so sl shimmy on down and get the green. All right, so now we have access to the green one. Awesome. Uh, okay. Ah, crap. All right, so... Turn those lights off. Open that door. Boom, boom. Turn those lights off, turn those lights off. Okay. Now, open that door. Open that door. And open that door. Is there anything in there that we need? It doesn't look like it. Which is probably a good thing. Wait for him to go through and we're gonna close this door. Okay. So now we can come up here. All right, that was a quiet one. Wire jack that. We've got access to the blues now. Uh, and the blue looks like there is... Okay. Open that door. Open that door. Open that door. Turn those lights off. Okay. So that's our main goal is right there. But we can hack the purple. All right, and then we've got a purple switch here that we can use to turn off the lights there. Open that door. Open that door. Okay, and we also need this, this red door open here. That's easily done. All right. So now we just need to avoid this guy so we can get to our main objective and the, the terminal here. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> Jump! All right, so the main objective is gone. Now if we say, connect that. We can close him in there, all right. There is a blue switch there, which is good. Uh, 
Uh, let's see here. Congratulations, Fitz Gessler to Rook. Congratulations, you effed me on the prototype thing. Guess what? I'm effing you back. The money you put into your husband's company, you're never getting it back. I have him by the balls. Any last words before I, ru before I finish ruining your life and your company? Good luck. All right, so that guy's knocked out. Everybody else is pretty well sealed up. A plus, yes, $8,000. Non-lethal, ghost, thoughtful. Whoo. Okay. Is it done? It's done. Fantastic. God, it's been a shitty few days. Thank you for ending it. You could thank me by telling me who killed Selena Delgado. Selena was killed by an agent codenamed Hightower. Wait. Yeah, codenamed Hightower on Gessler's orders. Gessler was blackmailing Jackson to stealing from me, but Jackson was planning to run off with Selena and the money. Gessler would have killed them both but the money was still in Jackson's name, so he took away Jackson's reason to run. I have enough evidence to put Gessler away, but he knows that now, but he knows that now. If you don't get him and Hightower tonight, they'll both be gone by morning. I still have access to Intex comms network. I've called Hightower to Intex HQ, told him Gessler wants to meet him, I strongly recommend you bring a gun, even if you don't intend to fire it. Thanks. I'm off to commit double homicide. Good luck, Richard. Come and effing get me. Don't mind if I do. So yes, now we need to buy the gate crashers, which means we can kick down doors which is an awesome skill that we're gonna have to wait until next time to see. <sighs> but I think that'll be the final mission and then it's and then this game's done. So yeah, that's coming up next time. As always, thank you guys very much for watching and don't forget to part the subscribe button down below so that you can stay tuned for more from Olav Production. If you want to see some crazy adults on Lacey, then you should meet me and my friends. They dwelled no in money, the witch realm of Angmar, but the White Council believed ooh, them all destroyed. Don't Clearly, they were wrong. We if you were good at your job, if you were good at running a news channel, tonight. you wouldn't worry about being demonetized. Making money shouldn't be all that it's about.